1935, Congress passed the Social Security Act. Yeah. <laughs> Set up a system of pensions for retired workers in private industry. <laughs> Social Security system has been broadened several times to include more workers and to increase the benefits. Oh. <laughs> now, uh, this Social Security, yes. <laughs> Could you get the actual number of um, quarters that uh, all of those in law enforcement have worked? <laughs> I made mention a few days ago that you'd probably only have Social Security. Well, I'd like to know the pensions of every police department. Yes. All the sheriff's departments. Yes. All the state patrols. Yes. And all of those in the school districts. Mm -hmm. And then how many of them are actually eligible to receive Social Security? Yes. If they weren't able to receive their pension. <laughs> now, these treason laws. Yes. I think I can sue you for your Social Security benefits. <laughs> so why don't you just give me all the individuals that are employed in Social Security? Yes. From the oldest employee of Social Security until the newest hire. Yes. Mm -hmm. Because I have a, a real big problem with those that make war against the people of the United States. See this treason that uh, I said yesterday? Yeah. Mm hmm that uh, you, you did that a couple years ago. Now, what did you do on January 4th of 2016? Mm -hmm. You arrested me for the allegation of violating the restraint provisions, knowing that I wasn't in Squim, Washington. Yes. Then you used uh, the judicial process to say that I was incompetent to stand trial. Right. Because you refused to admit the evidence that I wasn't in Squim. Mm -hmm. Now, I'd say that's war on the people. Mm -hmm. See, when you abuse your power as a police department, yes, because you got paid for the show, mm -hmm. and you had me arrested when you did know that I was on the bus on December 31st of 2015, yes, and I was in the library emailing, yeah, mm -hmm. King County Administrator, who, who was it that obstructed all my emails on December 31st of 2015, mm-hmm. I sent approximately 1,000 to 1,500 of them. I got very upset. Yes, I emailed every contact in my contacts. Yes, and then you only allowed for one email to get through. Yes, and that was the email that said, give me every IP address in the world. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Former Attorney General of the United States of America, Eric Holder. Yes, did you get an email from me? Yes where I emailed your law firm, mm -hmm. your email address, yes, uh, the old hotmail address of Heidi Budnick, yes, and myself, pooch. Now, I would say that the Attorney General's Office of the United States of America is personally liable. Why don't you get me the pensions and Social Security of those that work in the Department of Justice? <laughs> Eric Holder. Mm -hmm. former Attorney General of the United States of America. Mm -hmm. Did you receive an email from me on December 31st? Yes. Of 2015, where I documented that I wanted to know every IP address in the world. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, I've emailed the Department of Justice, mm -hmm. And it looks to me like the DOJ and all of its employees, yes, just give me their individual pensions, pooch. And then I want to know how many of the employees of the Department of Justice for the last 50 years uh -huh, have been eligible for Social Security. Now, I know you said that you... You put me in jail, yes, and you allowed for this court to prosecute me, knowing that I wasn't in Squim, Washington. Mm -hmm. And then you obligated me to have to stay in jail for 27 days so you could do a fraudulent mental health evaluation. Yes. When I had emailed law enforcement wanting notice of the state of jurisdiction, mm -hmm. you intentionally obstructed my right to know where court notices were being sent. Yes. Because Mike Van Proyen conspired with the county. Yes. To keep notices of court hearings from me. Right now. And then the Department of Justice of the United States. <laughs> 
decided yes. that they're going to miss prison, uh -huh. subversive activities on the part of this county and this state. Yes. And they decided they were going to miss prison treason. Mm -hmm. Now, Barr, oops, Loretta, oh. do the federal employees of the Department of Justice not understand that when you have knowledge of treason, right now, you are personally liable. Mm -hmm. Now, of all the Department of Justice email addresses that I have emailed, yes, how many email right now have documented the crime of kidnapping? Right. You know, for the idiot fucks that work in the DOJ, I will have you put in prison. Pounce!